Hello everyone. Today I'll be discussing question number 11 from gate 2014. So in this question four reactions are given. In that four reaction we need to answer which one will be allowed. A either A, B, C or D. So we will look at each reaction one by one. So for the first one this is proton and this is antiproton decaying to lambda 0. Here charge is balanced on both sides plus 1 minus 1 and this is 0 0 so charge is conserved. Okay. Now if we look into baryon number so for baryon number for proton is plus 1 and for antiproton it is minus 1 and on right hand side baryon number is plus 1 and plus 1 is equals to 2 and it is 0 on left hand side so baryon number is a fundamental quantity and it is not conserved on both sides so that means this is not allowed now moving on for C we can see here neutron going to proton electron and neutrino electron neutrino so in this charge is conserved okay baryon number is also conserved because neutron has baryon number one and proton has baryon number one now we will see lepton number lepton number on right left hand side is equals to zero and on right hand side it is plus 1 for electron and plus 1 again for electron neutrino so it is 2 on right hand side so that means lepton number which is a fundamental quantity is not conserved on this reaction for this reaction so that means this is also not allowed now for this d you know for this here we are given muon muon decaying to positron and gamma photon so we know there is a total lepton number which is equals to individual lepton number of electron muon and tion so we will if we see here total lepton number is conserved which is minus 1 on both side but individual lepton number is not conserved that is why this reaction will also not proceed because total lepton number and individual lepton number both should be conserved then only reaction will proceed so this is also wrong now if we see this one pi on negative p going to pi on 0 and charge is conserved on both side okay baryon number is also conserved on both side because the baryon number for proton is 1 and for neutron is 1 now if we look into isospin pi negative plus p going to pi 0 plus n if we look into isospin of pi negative so we know pions are triplets pi positive pi negative and pi 0 so 2i plus 1 is equals to 3 2i is equals to 2i is equals to 1 so isospin is 1 for pion and the third component of isospin iz varies from minus i to i is minus 1 to 1 is minus 1 0 1 so for pi positive it has value 1 1 and for pi 0 it has value 1 0 and for pi negative it is 1 minus 1 okay similarly for proton and neutron they are doublet so 1 i is equals to 1 by 2 so for proton it is 1 by 2 1 by 2 and for neutron it is 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2 now if we will see isospin here 
so pi on has one proton has one by two as isospin this is again one for pi zero and this is one by two so isospin is conserved now we will look into z component of isospin for pi on it is pi negative it is minus one and for proton it is one by two this is i i z okay so for pi zero it is zero for neutron it is minus one by two so solve here minus two plus one is goes to minus one by two left hand side and on right hand side it is also minus one by two so charge is conserved baryon number is conserved and uh, isospin is conserved iz is also conserved now we will look into strangeness so if we go through this table we can see for proton and no, uh, neutron the strangeness is zero and similarly for pi zero and pi negative strangeness is zero so to find out strangeness there is one formula gelman nisija formula uh, which says q is equals to i3 plus b plus s by 2 q is charge i3 is third component of isospin b is baryon number and s is strangeness if suppose uh, suppose i need to find out the uh, strangeness of proton uh, so for proton charge is 1 i3 is 1 by 2 just now solved baryon number is 1 s by 2 so 1 minus 1 by 2 this 1 by 2 will go on left hand side 1 by 2 1 plus s is equals to 2 2 2 will cancel s is equals to 0 so similarly you can find out the uh, strangeness for neutron and other uh, so we'll see that each and every quantity is conserved that means b is the correct answer which will be allowed okay thank you